It means something more than just a man who couldn't hear and couldn't speak, and now we can. Something more to this. So let's look at the more of it. Because first of all, what do those two actions do to us? If Jesus did it to you, or I did it to you, if I stuck my finger into your ear, and I put spit on my hand and put it on your tongue, it would immediately throw us off balance. It would immediately make us uncomfortable. It would immediately throw us off the way things. We would just get very, very, very discombobulated in a sense, right? Those two actions have, have capacity to do that to us in seconds. And here's a man, again, if you think a little bit deeper, he can't hear, he can't speak. What is this man? He can see. This man is obviously an observer of the world, right? He can never take any information in, he can't take any new information, he can't hear anybody. And he can't speak, he can't engage the world, he can't dialogue with anyone. He is the quintessential observer. He just sees things, just watches. And all of his processing is up here. It's all from his point of view. It's all from what he can see. And Jesus throws him off guard, pushes him off of that, and says to him, be open. Be open. And obviously, again, the deeper, what is Jesus saying? Be open to, he's not saying be open, you can not even hear, you can go around and listen to the music, or now you can go around and speak to everybody. What Jesus is saying, be open to the bigger vision. Your vision is so small. All you see is what you see, that's it. All you think about is what you think about. Be open. And now you have the capacity to hear. Now you have the capacity to engage. Now you have the capacity to, to recognize the vision. And the, of course, Jesus is speaking about the vision of his Father. The vision of the reign of God is much bigger than your little vision. Get over yourself. Get off your, your comfort zone. And the finger in his ear and the spit on his tongue, he upsets the man enough that he's able to get his attention and just simply says, be open. It changes the man's world. He opens. The vision of God is bigger.